friends, welcome to the Zangsta International Airport. Oh yes, the Zangsta International Airport. The northwestern region of the island. Um, the western region. Wherever I go, I'll take you with me, no problem. Now my name is Joan and um, welcome to my YouTube channel. Why not? Grandma. Why not Grandma Jamaica? So here we are at the Sangsta International Airport and we are making our way down to the airport. And I do have, it's a busy day, it's a busy day today. So many vehicles and um, for those persons coming in who haven't been here for a while, well at least for the month of January, there's a situation going on because we no longer have the gas station here at the airport and uh, the snap counters and all those little business, small entities, business entities that were in the center area. Those are not there anymore. What is happening really is that it's now a parking lot in that region and they're doing some changes, some renovation is going on. But I think by the end of this month, of January, I think by the end of January 2020, 2024, it's, it's, you know, I don't think, I just think it's gonna maybe take another two weeks or so. So after this month, it should be okay, but there are a lot of changes, and it, be, it can be confusing for those who are just coming in, haven't been here for a while, or those who are just leaving. That's in terms of driving. Hold on, because it's noisy. It's noisy. So coming in from the main road, this is what we're looking at. And uh, so these vehicles, it looks a little bit confusing. But they're in the process of getting it uh, very nice for us. Now this is actually the Sanctus International Airport and one of the largest in the region. So this is the overnight parking, overnight parking lot and um, you do so at your own risk. Yeah man, Donald Sangster, Donald Sangster, a visionary leader, an economic strategist. I tell you this, this guy, very brilliant fellow, one of the architect of our Jamaican economy. <laughs> indeed, 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 indeed. Statesman and the second prime minister. Yeah, man. Lots of work, lots and lots of work going on. Oh, a lot of work. This is going to be so beautiful when they're finished. But the month of January, January 2024, man. It's a mess, it's a mess, it's a mess. But it's worth it, it's gonna be worth it. The entire center area is not as you know it to be, you know? Changes, changes. But changes, change is good. Positive change is good. So I can just imagine. I can just imagine. It's gonna look so beautiful when they're finished with it. I can't wait for March to see what March looks like. Maybe February. Who knows? Prime Minister, the Honorable Andrew Holness, on October 26. Yes, the anniversary of the late. Sir Donald Sangster stated that it was Sangster's vision that drove the establishment of Jamaica's second international airport. And here we are, here we are. I love Montego Bay. 
Definitely, definitely. The view is beautiful. YouTube in us, hello. <laughs> oh. Yeah, my no problem. So we're going across here. Yeah. Okay. The sun is firing. <laughs> It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Here we are. So you can see behind me. We still have the beautiful. It's beautiful, right? Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Now, how are you doing? How are you doing? Here we are once more. Another beautiful day. Beautiful day. So um at the Sanctus International Airport, and like I've told you, wherever I go, I'll take you with me. No problem. Now my name is Joan and um welcome to my YouTube channel. Why not Grandma? Why not Grandma Jamaica? And listen, loved ones and friends as we go throughout our day-to-day -day activities you know sometimes for me it brings you pretty much out here on the streets where i can tell you a little bit about jamaica show you a little here and a little there so i might not spend much time at home like the typical grandma but that's no problem right that is definitely no problem Are you seeing the beautiful scenery over there on the hillside? Please subscribe to my channel and um, tell me where you're viewing from. Don't forget to like and hit the notification bell so you can know what grandma is up to, okay? Now I'm gonna tell you a little about the international airport. I'm gonna get inside to do that. All right, let's go. Everything went for so crowded, so crowded. So crowded, crowded. We'll do this later, we'll talk later. We will talk, talk later. So there's still confusion because we're in the arrival area and earlier we were in the, um, the departure area and um, it is still pretty much confusing as to where exactly, look behind me, look at that, where exactly we are to walk, you know, so we're just going through, you know, we're figuring it out as we go along. But I know that in a few weeks, it's going to be so beautiful. So here we go, here we go, here we go. Yeah, it's good to be with you, good to be with you again and again and again. Oh, you're assisting. He's assisting you. <laughs> He's okay. I can take my ID off. Okay. Oh, that we are out here. So we say you repeat yourself, Mama. She's getting assistance there. <laughs> He's getting assistance. Yes, 
yes, it's evening time. Work is over now, it's evening time. Oh, yes. Time to play. So, the airport was named after the our Sangster. Then our songster got very, very brilliant fellow and um, he got into politics at age 21. And I'm going to give you more information on him. I just wanted you to see the airport and then we talk about him later on. Beautiful. Let's figure out going across this place. Later on, we're gonna talk about this gentleman. When we get home, we'll talk, all right? This airport is one of the largest in the Caribbean. And we actually have three international airports here there is one in Kingston our capital city you know our industrial city and we have one in Ocherius as well that's the smallest of the three the airports seem to have more parking lot than anything else we're expecting big things I'm wondering if it has anything to do with um, the comic there with um, what is it hard hard rock resort showing you the view I'm actually searching for the parking lot but um, the, the camera and I are fighting actually but yes so parking lots parking lots all over you know oh where is she she had stopped she's not coming all right that's fine okay here we are again i am trying to ensure that yes you can see me clearly oh man i love this i love this okay let me see how long i can hold this for okay let me give you the information before my hands get really tired because what i'm doing is pretty crazy anything for you you know how it is right so we spoke about the airport, um, Sangsa International Airport, and it was named after Sir Donald Sangster. And I do not want to repeat information that I had already given you. So, Donald Sangster was actually born in 1911, and um from birth he was pretty much a blessed child in that he he was a community person and very charismatic very thoughtful very caring sweet child so his dad was in to the purchasing of lands and all that but I don't want to get into all that because you can always do your research there's a book 
done by Nayat, Nayat, Nayat. Don't remember that guy's name either. The Forgotten Prime Minister, yes. You can research that. But what I actually want to tell you is that this guy was the most short-lived Prime Minister that we had. 48 days. Hmm. That's questionable, right? 48 days. And it is said that he was, that he died of natural cause, that he had, what's that? Um, sub, 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 sub hemorrhage. Um, it, it's really bleeding in the brain. And, um, but what happened is that he had, this guy, he, he did, he did exceptionally well in building the Jamaican economy. And he was deputy to the first prime minister. And actually that prime minister had, had fallen ill during his tenure. And he was actually bedridden for three years. And who do you think ran the country then? Yeah, man, the famous Sir Donald Sangster. And he did so well. And when election came around, who do you think won that election? He did. So yes, he was well loved by the first prime minister, one he was deputy to, and he was doing so well, became prime minister, but the, 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 the previous prime minister did not like him as, did not like him very well. No, he loved him as deputy, but not when he became prime minister. And you know, shortly after that, you heard that he got ill and had this disease, this situation, had to be flown to, to, to Canada where, you know, he was being treated and so on. Next thing you know is that he died and that was pretty shocking, you know. And then one wonders... But then they say it's natural cause and we're going to leave it at that. We're not going to be using our imagination and we're not going to be coming up with any anky panky or anything of the sort. We are definitely going to be, you know, accepting that which the information which has been given to us. But Donald Sangster, Donald Sangster, Sir Donald Sangster, the forgotten Prime Minister and the 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 international airport the sangsta international airport you know was his vision and it is it is doing so well as it relates to tourism exceptionally well you know we, we did a an extension of the runway recently and i am not sure if all these development what i can say is that we're expecting big things <laughs> we're expecting big things i'm not sure what it is that is in the pipeline the only thing i know about is the, the hard rock resort that is being built right now and definitely that is going to be attracting so many persons and we are most grateful you know for tourism the expansion and all that so that's the story you can um do your research you can do your research as it relates to Donald Sangster and to get um, as much information there as is possible. But this gentleman was just exceptional, very good lawyer. He was, he was, he became the f a finance minister. I think it was in, uh, f I think it was in 1955 that he got that position. And then um, in the 60s, he continued with that. Uh, when he became prime minister, he was his own finance minister. I mean, the man is just, he's just brilliant. Brilliant lawyer he was, you know. 
went into politics so early and did so well. So, my friends, that is it really. That is it. That is it. Um, this should have been, video should have been uploaded. And I apologize that it is just going up. But you know what? It's the end of the month and it's crazy at the airport. So I was thinking that maybe the end of March is going to be okay. But I think it's probably going to be in summer. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Because when I look at the center of what's happening down there, I do not see anything that tells me, okay, this is going to be that. Or it's going to be A, it's going to be B, it's going to be C. Uh, not visible right now. So um, let's see how that turned out. But I just want you to know that I am grateful. Very delighted to be able to serve you. I am not taking it for granted. You're very special. And I am pleased, yes, that I am sharing cyberspace with you. We continue on our journey. And don't forget to subscribe and share the link and, and tell me where you're viewing from, you know. And if there's anything you want me to talk about or so, you just let me know. Thank you very much. And just remember to be good. And if you can't be, please be careful. All right. Take care and see you in the next video when why not grandma why not grandma will be coming up with a new content as often as is possible daily if it's possible all right so you take her and i'll see you i'll see you tomorrow all right bye-bye